We are getting ready to go on a long run. I am gonna do seven miles today. Uh, I'm doing a there and back, which means I'm gonna run about three and a half, turn around, all uphill, coming back, all downhill for the most part, going there. Stacy, however, hey Stacy. Hi. <laughs> Looks like she's gonna rob a bank. Is gonna run 12 today. So the overall plan is, is I'm gonna keep the GoPro with me um, until we get a second one. Sooner or later, we'll be able to record simultaneously. We plan to have one by our first race, which is later this month. But I'm gonna keep it with me, but she's gonna keep running straight. Hers is mostly downhill. I mean, she's gonna have some uphills here and there, but it's not like, you know, uh, it's it's 12 miles. So she says it's a wimpy 12, but it's still 12 miles. It is more, it's not like extreme downhill, but it is. She doesn't have the uphills to combat with coming back, which is a little bit in her favor, but it's still, it's 12 miles. So I don't want to underestimate that. But the plan is, is I'll turn around, run the uphill crap back, and then I'll go get in the car and pick her butt up 12 miles down the road. Then we're eating pizza today, because uh, we earned it, hopefully. According to our Cali trackers, we should be able to fit it in. We'll see. Uh, no dogs today. Stacy's dog maxes out about four. She's not in the best shape, we realize that. She she can do four, but after four, you're dragging her. And she's a 50 pound dog. Nobody wants to drag 50 pounds. And then my dog, Panda, uh, she can do seven, but her paws start to get a little worn because we're doing mostly roads because I'm not gonna run off in the snow. And also, uh, Leaving one dog behind while taking the other one feels unfair. I don't know, I'm weird like that, I guess. Just feels unfair. So I like to try to keep it even. Uh, other things, it's 25 degrees Fahrenheit right now. It's a nice sunny day, as you can see, but I'm cold right now. I can't wait to actually start getting running, hopefully warm up. I didn't bring a jacket, got my gloves, got my hat, I got my audio book. Listening to the Mistborn book three, if you're all wondering, it's okay. Um, I got music on backup in case I need it. And I got my watch. Uh, by the way, why don't people make shirts I can't point and hold the camera where this covers up, but like the watch sticks out. I hate having to pull my sleeve back. It gets cold. Just saying. Uh, either than that, let's go ahead. Three, two, one. Here we go. Uh, 12 minute pace today. Once again, that's what Run With Hal is telling me to do. Stacy is gonna, I think, do 12 minutes as well, at least with me. Um, I don't know what her plant pace is afterwards. Stacy, what's your plant pace afterwards? Whatever I can run. Whatever she can run pace. <laughs> um, so, I'm sure she'll tell us afterwards. I'll make sure that she includes her stats as well, since her run is different, um, before or after mine. And we are going- Too fast. Too fast, running over some ice right there. Oh my goodness. Maybe I should have brought the jacket. <laughs> I'm thinking mistakes were made, people. Uh, we snowed about, it's hard to tell. We got about a foot over the last couple of days. Today's the first day we've seen the sun in a week, maybe. Um, but a foot, we were getting avalanche warnings, stuff like that for our area. Like literally on the mountain we live on behind us, avalanche warnings. So, um, cold freaking week. But hey, looks pretty, right? See Stacy running in her ninja outfit. I think I'm pointing it at her. Uh, we come to about a, we come to a T and just under a mile from where we start. I'm gonna go a different direction today, capture some different footage for you. Plus, since Stacy's doing the long run, that way's longer. The other way goes to our nearest town, which isn't near, but nearest town. She's gonna far surpass that town, so the other way's further. So, uh. Plus, it's towards the pizza.
All right, we're coming up to the T. I was talking about where we got it left or right. I'm gonna go left today. I don't like go right. I like that route. You can see where the road drops off. It's a decent hill going down over that, right over there. Um, which means, of course, I gotta come back up that crap. Uh, looks like there's some smoke coming off the mountain over there. Hopefully it's not a fire and just somebody burning something, but yeah. Uh, nothing else to say at the moment besides it's cold. I should have brought the jacket. It would be easier just to, if I got warm to put the jacket around my waist or something. Um, I thought, oh, it looks sunny. It looks so much warmer than it is. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see my breath. I can see my breath occasionally. It's cold. Uh, so yeah, learn from my mistakes. Also, you might notice I'm chewing the gum. I've noticed actually going back and rewatching my videos. I chew gum in almost my running videos. I never realized it. Um, I don't think it does me any favors, to be honest with my breathing. But I don't know, it kind of takes my mind off of stuff. So. So hopefully you guys can see the hill. Let's get a decent drop off. And then you can see it come back in the distance. Come back up a bit. Uh, there is some uphill for me and Stacy on this, obviously. Uh, going before I hit the turnaround, but for her as well. Just mostly downhill, but yeah, you can see as it starts to drop off there. Um, and then some more of our mountains that we live on. And some fields. Because sometimes people like to see snows, fields covered in snow. All right, one mile, 12.07. So we're, uh, the run with Hal says I should be at 12.05. Technically, I just aimed for 12 because it's even in my mind. Uh, so we're two seconds behind pace, which I'll take. Um, so yeah, 12.07, first mile. All right, we're at the bottom of the first hill. We're now starting uphill, not the uphill on the return, but an uphill. Uh, turn the camera around in a minute. Oh, uh, this uphill's about, if I remember, a mile long or so. Um, and then it goes back to downhill. So, I, yeah. All right, so it might make sense that I go three and a half miles and then leave Stacy there. But given the length of her run versus my run, we're taking different routes. So we're about a mile and a half in. We're gonna wave bye to Stacy. Wish her luck on her 10 and a half miles. You got this, keep pushing. And uh, yeah, she's definitely got the harder run than me. Uh, so here we go. Solo now. I'm now running into the wind. I had the wind kind of at her backside. Should have brought that jacket. Really should have. I'm gonna tough it out. But uh I'm allergic to the cold, the kind of stuff. at least that's what I tell people. If you guys notice, hopefully not. Everybody knows this, because it's freaking cold. Uh, 25 degrees, but this wind chill that I'm running into, I'm cold. Uh, mile two, 11.46, 23.50 something, I missed it overall. Five miles to go. Uh, yeah. This route is a course 
all downhill as well. So, uh, second half of this thing, because I turned before we actually, before the uphill that we showed you, Stacy's running up, the, up that hill right now. I turned and keep going downhill. So she'll get the benefit of going back down that other side of that hill. But I just get the benefit of all downhill right now. But uh, a pain of a climb on the way back. Hills are good though. Hills are good. Oh, I missed it. Uh, overall, I'm 34, 47, mile three, which means that mile was too fast. Uh, 11 minutes something. I don't know. Uh, I don't want to math. I'm cold. But uh, too fast. But overall, I'm a minute 15 or so. I had a pace. Slow it down a little bit. Uh, if Stacy's maintaining about the same pace, it means she's got about nine miles to go. Halfway point at just over 40 minutes. Now uphill. Time to push. Mile four was at 1041. Definitely too fast. You need to bring it down. And 4514 overall. Mile five was 1103, so too fast. 56 something too fast. Mile six was 1117. I really need to slow down. Overall, I'm at an hour eight. Okay, that was pretty hard. Um, I've done GoPro. I guess maybe it's 17%, uh, 10 seconds or so at a time. That's why check-ins from basically four miles an hour were quick and abrupt. <coughs> I wanna sit down, but <coughs> that's the only place to sit down and I'm not gonna sit down in snow. It's roughly three and a half miles all uphill. Pretty decent climb for somebody in my, my condition. Um, I don't know the elevation gain. Once again, Stacy will do her thing. Uh, overall, it was a good run. I'm tired. It kicked my butt. <coughs> um, yeah. I get pizza tonight. I think my watch said like 960 calories burned. Um, for those wondering, oh, my time. My average heart rate was 159. All uphill, one hour, 20 minutes, 17 seconds. I don't know that average. I know it's faster than it was supposed to be. I only maybe was doing 12 minute pace on the way back for the last mile. I can't see him. This is wonderful shooting, I know. Uh, oh, I'm on my phone, so format change. It's a mess, I'm tired, race done. If it was easy, you wouldn't do it. Was that a JFK basically, paraphrasing that, but yeah. I had to push really hard. Uh, and motivate myself for the last bit. If anybody saw me, they're probably thinking, there goes the crazy slow runner talking to himself. But uh, yeah, like I said, last mile was, <sighs> it was rough um, overall. So <sighs> seven mile run done. <sighs> Somehow I gotta add 19 more to that. Ay ay ay, what did I sign up for? Yeah, thank you. Keep pushing.